Well, key, keep, uh, pardon me, keeping walkers, runners, and bicyclists safe, that's becoming a big concern for Huntsville city leaders, especially on the narrow, fast-moving South Memorial Parkway. Way 31's Luke Hydas joins us live now. And Luke, you've been digging into just how dangerous this situation is. Yeah, Chris, Megan, it's really easy to see. Just do a Google search on your phone. You know, Way 31 pedestrian hit Memorial Parkway. You'll see tons and tons of headlines this year alone, multiple. And if you go back 2020, 2019, they just really add up. Now, we all know how far this parkway stretches. It's a big old part of Huntsville. There's about 14 interchanges, actually, between the parkway and some of these off-roads. And as Huntsville is growing, so are the amount of people getting onto this parkway who are walking or riding their bike. And in some cases, they're ended up being hit. So Huntsville really wants to make this a safer situation. The city now exploring new possibilities and they're working with a developer to potentially make some long term changes. Now, there's really no specifics to these changes yet, but the bottom line from city leaders is the same. Make Memorial Parkway safer for everyone. What we want to do is look at the interchanges up and down the parkway and say, what can we do to make these not just car friendly, but also bike and pedestrian friendly? Well, I want to see them do stuff. So, you know, just having a meeting and not do anything. But it looks like they're actually um, going to actively do stuff. And just after six o'clock now, you can already see traffic picking up behind me and it's only going to get worse as the day goes on. And we all know how narrow the parkway is, so it really is a dangerous situation. There's no money set aside yet for any of these projects, but Huntsville city leaders say that could be coming in the near future. Live in Huntsville this morning, Luke Hyde-Ash, Way 31 Newton.